What if I told you a $200 million power plant was destroyed not by a storm or sabotage, but by a butane lighter? It sounds crazy, but it's true. And the story of how this happened is one of the most unbelievable tailies of industrial disaster IV ever heard. It happened in 1993 at a state-of-the-art power plant in Alabama. The facility wasn't even operational yet. It was still being tested before its grand opening. And one day, a technician was inspecting a circuit board that had failed during testing. The area wasn't brightly lit. So instead of grabbing a flashlight, he pulled out a butane lighter to get a better look. And in that moment, disaster struck. Unbeknownst to him, a small leak of hydrogen gas had filled the air. Invisible, odorless, and highly explosive. The lighter's flame was all it took. The gas ignited instantly. A massive explosion tore through the plant, wrecking equipment, blowing apart structures, and reducing millions of dollars worth of technology to rubble. The official report uh, helpfully referred to the lighter as an ignition device, but everyone knew the truth. One flick of a lighter had caused $200 million in damages and delayed. The plant's launched by more than a year! Now, I don't normally tell stories like this to shame the people involved, because accidents happen. But I think this story is a reminder that in high-stakes engineering, you can't afford to take shortcuts. No matter how small, even a tiny flame can burn through hundreds of millions of dollars.